Let's solve smallest even multiple. So we have a positive integer, it's called n, that is the parameter that we get for this function. And we have to return the smallest positive integer that is a multiple of both the number two and the value n. Let's say we have five here as the input. We can divide five by two. So there is no number that you can multiply by two to get five. I'm talking about integers. The answer here is five times two, which is 10. In this case, we have the number six. You can multiply three by two to get six and multiply six by one to get six. So in this case, the smallest multiple of both six and two is the number six itself. So you can return the parameter n itself depending on the inputs. Here I have an example of my own. If the number is 24, it's an even number, just like for example two here. So we just return the number n. In this case, how you do this is check first if the value of n is an even number, and if it is, return the value n by itself. Otherwise, if it's an odd number, you have to return the value n multiplied by two. And this code here that you see in the code editor is the full solution for this lead code problem. So let me submit this right away. And we've passed everything in zero milliseconds. If you like my C++ solution, please subscribe and I'll catch you next time.